Time to rock out again at Alumni Hall as women's basketball hosts Hofstra. Battle of two unbeaten teams as both the Stags and the Pride enter with a perfect 3-0 record, the final game before the Thanksgiving holiday for both teams. Hofstra returning all but one player from a team that was selected to the WNIT a season ago after winning over 20 games. The Stags, though, held their own in the first quarter and had a chance to really put their mark on this game. Casey Smith would put the Stags on the board and then the scoring machine as of late, Kelsey Carey hits a jumper. However, those were the only field goals the Stags would hit in the first quarter. They trailed by eight at halftime. Second half, Stags found their offensive groove. Fairfield would score 38 points in the final 20 minutes after scoring just 14 in the first half. Carey and Smith helped lead the Stags to that number, combining for 33 points tonight. Still at the comeback, Samantha Cooper. That put the Stags within five in the fourth quarter. A Carey free throw made it a four-point game. But then Hostra couldn't miss. They shot 60% from behind the arc in the second half, including three of their final four to extend that four-point lead. And in the end, they did just enough to give the Stags their first loss of the season, 67-53. Disappointed. Um, you know, Hofstra's a really talented team. We had a great scout, and we knew what they were going to do. We knew that there were certain things that they were going to do that we would struggle to guard, just simply by, based on matchups. Um, their guards are very, very gifted. We knew they'd be physical, so there were, there were no surprises with what they did. Although, in their point guard, Luciano, um, shot the ball better than at least statistically she had in the past. I mean, she was on fire tonight, which makes her doubly hard to guard because she's really, really good off the bounce, good off the ball screen. But just really disappointed. I thought we were very flat again in the first 10 minutes. Kind of similar, very similar to the way we came out against Sacred Heart the other night, but we were able to turn it around against them. Um, but you can't get in that mode where you come out as sluggish as we did. And I'm not quite sure why that's happened because the first two games of the year, we came out like we were shot out of a cannon when we played against LaSalle and, and Loyola. Got off to great starts and really essentially won both of those games in the first half. And then the last two games, we haven't changed anything in our pregame rep, uh, preparation or anything, but we've got to find a way to, to, to come out uh, better than we did tonight.